In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to save time by efficiently copy-pasting your sketches onto different sides of a solid body. We'll be working with a dice model today, but the technique applies to any shape. Step 1. Selecting your sketch. Start by selecting the sketch you want to reuse. In our case, we're going to apply it to a face of the dice that hasn't been sketched yet. Now, pay close attention here. Your first selection point matters. It determines the pivot point, and you'll see how that plays out when we move the sketch. Step 2. Fusion offers several types of moves, and it's worth getting familiar with all of them. For this scenario, the point-to-point -point move is your best bet. It's fast, precise, and perfect for placing your sketch exactly where you want it. Here's how it works. You'll start by picking your origin point the sketch's current location, and then select the target point where you want to move it. Simple, right? Quick tip, make sure to check the Create Copy option. If you forget, your sketch will just move, not copy, leaving you without the original. Step 3. Adjusting the pivot point. Now, let's talk about the pivot point. If you try rotating the sketch right now, you'll notice something. It rotates around the first shape you selected. In this case, it's the top left circle, which may not be ideal. Had we selected the central circle, we'd be perfectly aligned. But no worries. Fusion makes it easy to change the pivot point. Just adjust it manually and don't forget to confirm your choice before moving forward. Once everything's aligned, hit OK and your sketch is now perfectly placed and rotated. That's it for this time-saving trick. If you found this helpful, don't forget to subscribe for more quick tips and check out the playlist linked on the screen. Plus, you'll find links to additional courses in the description below. Thanks for watching.